morning children welcome back to your ss class today we will continue block 14 we have already studied lesson 1 and 2 right yes which are the lessons yeah pages of india and food of india so in today's class we will learn about lesson 3 and lesson 4 which are clothes of india and folk culture of india so let's start today's class with lesson 3 that is clothes of india as we know that people wear different types of clothes in different parts of india am i right yes what type of clothes you can see around your house what kind of clothes wear the people of your neighborhood yes we can see different type of clothes uh, worn by the men and women which are they yes sarees mundi shirt churidar different type of clothes every states of india has their own regional clothes isn't it yes regional clothes when do they wear this regional clothes yes most of the people wear regional clothes during any festivals or during any celebrations birthday of the child harvest festival or any celebration so people wear their regional clothing during festivals or wedding functions so today in today's class we will learn about different types of clothes worn by the people of india in south india the clothes worn by the people of south india is entirely different from north india and also different from east india and west india so let discuss let's discuss about the clothes of south india west india north india and east india so can you see which are the type of what kind of clothes wear the people of north india yes people of north india women wear salwar kameez women wear salwar kameez what about men ha ah, kurta and pajama pajama kurta pajama kurta then south india we all are in south india what kind of clothes do we wear yes sari we are worn by women what about men yes mundi shirt mundi and shirt mundi shirts then west india west india also women wear sari take like gujarat and rajasthan women wear a type of dress that is known as ghagra choli that we have already studied in the lesson the shirt people wear in the shirt of rajasthan a uh, woman wear ghagra choli that is colorful uh, skirt with the saree and ghagra choli and the dhoti kurta dhoti kurta the east indian women wear a special type of cloth that is known as meghala chadar meghala chadar meghala chadar then men wear dhoti and kurta dhoti kurta this are the traditional clothing of or regional clothing of indian people here first we can discuss north india the people of north india or women they are selma selwar kameez and the men wear pajama and kurta then in south indian people women wear sari men wear mundi and shirt then west india women wear sari and ghagra choli that's a kind of uh, clothes worn by women in uh, gujarat and rajasthan 
then dhoti and kurta worn by worn by men of west india last one east india the women in east india wear a special kind of cloth that is known as meghla chadar then the men of east india they wear dhoti and a kurta meghla chadar this is especially worn by the women in assam these are the regional clothing of india do we see people wear this regional clothing every day no why we all are wearing uh, dresses that is comfortable comfortable for us which are there people mostly wear other kind of clothes like pants shirt t-shirt mundan shirt churidars uh, uh, trousers like that why do we use this kind of dresses because these are comfortable for our day to day life when do we use this regional clothes we are using we are wearing this regional clothes during the any special occasions like festivals and uh, wedding functions um, but all other days we are wearing some other kind of comfortable clothes like pants shirt t-shirt trousers uh, chudidars like that okay so i hope you clear the clothes of india so you have to read about uh, the clothes of india from your content book then let's move to the next lesson lesson 4 then let's start so lesson 4 for culture of this lesson we will learn about folk dances and folk songs of india every state have their own folk dances and folk songs in lesson we will discuss about the important folk songs and folk uh, dances of india these folk songs do you know what is folk songs these are the traditional songs it's performed by the people for many years folk songs or folk dance have been performed by the people of any region or any state for many years it's usually performed during any special occasions like festivals and a wedding when do we celebrate this folk dances and folk song this folk songs and folk dances perform have been pro performed by the people of india for many years it performed during special occasions it performed during special occasion performed during wedding performed during wedding or festivals then birth birthday celebrations when do we perform this folk dance and folk songs we perform uh, these folk dances and folk songs during wedding functions or our any festivals or birthday functions dances and folk songs performed by men and women across the country in earlier time people of villages only performed these folk dances and folk songs but nowadays people in cities and uh, towns also performing these uh, folk dances and folk songs during the special occasions like wedding functions harvest festivals uh, or any other celebrations okay in today's class we will learn about different types of folk dances and folk songs so first we can discuss about the folk dances of india folk dances folk dances usually performed during the special occasions like uh, wedding functions uh, birthday functions and any festivals like harvest festival or regional uh, or religious festivals okay mostly these folk dances performing in group this is performing in group may be performed by men sometimes only women sometimes it 
performed by men and a woman. Okay, so we can discuss which are the folk dances of India. Bangla, Bangla, Garba, Garba, Kumi, Bihu. Okay, in today's class we will discuss about some important folk dances like Bangla, Garba, Kumi, Piko. First we can discuss Bangla. Dance of India Bangla performed in Punjab. This is an important art form or dance of Punjab. Folk dance of Punjab. It performed by men of Punjab. Only it performed by men during the harvest festival. This Bangla dance performed by men during the harvest fest festival in Punjab. Garba dance it performed but in Gujarat, Garba is a dance of Gujarat. It performed by men and women. Men and women. Garba it is a dance of Gujarat performed by men and women. Then Kumi, dance of Tamil Nadu. Tamil Nadu. This is also performed by men and women. Men, women. During harvest festival. The next one, Bihu. This is a, we have already studied this Bihu dance performed by Assamis during the har harvest festival. Assamis harvest festival by men and women. This this dance performed by men and the women. These are the important folk dances. Okay, let's discuss folk songs. These all folk dances are performing in groups. Sometimes it may be in, uh, performed by men and then some dances performed by men and the women. Okay, let's move to the next topic, folk songs. These folk songs are also sung during fe in festivals like wedding festivals, wedding functions, and the birthday of child. Birth songs, birth songs, wedding songs, wedding songs. Bhatiyari is another folk song of India that sung by the boatman of West Bengal. This Vatyali is sung by boatman of West Bengal. The next one Soha. This is sung by the Biharis during the birthday of a child. Okay. So mostly these songs performed during wedding or birthday of child or harvest festival. Okay. So how do the people of India remember or learn these folk dances and folk songs? Yes, they learn these folk dances and folk songs from their elders. Folk dances and the folk songs passed from elder pupil to younger pupil. For example, someone in Assam will learn Bihu dance form from their elders and they will teach this art form or this folk dance to their younger people. Okay, so hope you clear these two lessons. Let's discuss S3 clothes of India. Question number one match the state with the clothes A Punjab, B Gujarat, C West Bengal. Which is a matching one? Punjab, Salwar Kameez, Gujarat, Gagra Choli and West Bengal Sari. Then second question. Choose one of the state from the above. You can choose any one of the state from above. That means Punjab, Gujarat or West Bengal. And draw the regional dress of that state in the box and color it. 
so choose one state and a regional clothes of state in the given box and color it then third question why don't people wear their regional clothes every day explain with reason we wear t-shirts pants every day because it is comfortable and easy to wear let's discuss s4 for culture of india first question look at the picture carefully write the name of the folk dances of each state first one folk dance of gujarat garba then folk dance of punjab bagra folk dance of tamil nadu kummi folk dance of assam bihu next question number 3 imagine that is a harvest season in india which folk dance will you choose to perform and why you can write here i would choose bihu because men both men and women can perform this dance okay that's all today thank you